Hello students, welcome to our YouTube channel. Say, uh, see, as I said that I will be bringing the important type of questions. See, there are few chapters on which, in which I, we can predict the type of questions which can be asked because of the limited syllabus. Because the syllabus has been reduced, they have deleted so many portions. So, for today, we will be discussing it about 3D geometry. In 3D geometry chapter, see, that's the list like what, which type of question you may expect in your J maze. It's distance between two skew lines which is a direct formula based question and you should be able to solve it if it comes to you uh, in front of you in your examination next this is extremely important question based on the line of shortest distance for two given lines see I do the figure here let's say these are two skew lines what does I mean is the question based on this line a line which is perpendicular to both the skew lines okay so line along with the shortest distance is obtained now what can be the type of question the type of question can be based on these points of intersection the p and q where this line which is perpendicular to both the skew lines meet line l1 and l2 there can be several main different type of questions okay so this is very important you should be able to get this point p you should be able to get this point Q and then any question asked based on this line PQ you can solve it for sure okay this is extremely important and then see uh, I will try to bring a detailed video a detailed video on these type of question with the example for sure okay but right now let's know which type of question distance of a given point from the line so if that's the line that's the point a so that's the perpendicular distance so one is this thing and important for me uh, what i expect is distance along a given direction that means not a perpendicular direction but any other given direction and then foot of perpendicular drawn from a point on the line so if that's the point you draw perpendicular that's your foot of perpendicular so this might be important and of course we use it to find the image of the point on the line and foot of perpendicular is the midpoint of object and the image and then at last very important based on vector okay the geometry of the figure like I just drew an example for example I drew a figure this is a quadrilateral okay and there's a line PQ which divide BC and AB in some given ratio then you are asked to find the area the ratio of the area of this triangle and that triangle using maybe the cross product so these are the type of questions which are going to be extremely extremely important for this J main January session but you